Welcome to quarantine workout number five, living room core. This workout includes no equipment and just your living room floor. This workout includes three sets. Each set will be repeated three times with a total of eight exercises. Let's get into the first set. For the first set, you're going to do sit-ups with either a couch or a loved one bracing your feet as fast as you can for one minute. Following that, you will do reverse crunches. You can hold on to the bottom of your couch or bottom of a chair or someone's feet if you like or nothing at all. Keep your legs at a 90 degree angle, touch your toes to the ground, lifting back up and lift your butt off the ground as you do that reverse crunch. Repeat those two exercises three times through with as little rest as possible. For your second set, you will perform V-ups. V-ups you can do while bracing the floor, allow your legs and your body to go parallel to the floor, then bring them both up as a V shape. Try not to bend in your knees and do as many as you can. Secondly, you will be doing a side plank. You wanna make sure your elbow and your shoulder are in alignment, your feet are stretched out to your side, keeping your feet in alignment with your hips and shoulders nice and straight. You're gonna hold on to the side, allowing your hip to come down to the floor and lift it back up. If this is too hard for you, then you wanna go into half plank. For this, you can bend your bottom knee, allowing the knee to touch the floor. Your other leg can stay extended straight out, keep the same positioning, and bring your hip to the floor and back up. The third exercise in this set is going to be thread the needle. You're gonna to wanna to bring the upper arm up straight in the air. You're gonna reach under to the side of your body that is facing the floor, twisting, and then bring that arm back up straight into the air. Hold that plank position as best as you can. If you need to go to a half plank, again, you can bend your knee. Your final set in this series will consist of slow crunches. Go ahead and put your hands either behind your head or across your shoulders. Crunch up, squeeze at the top, and release nice and slow. From these, you will head right into nice and slow controlled bicycles. For a bicycle, you're gonna start with your knees bent at a 90 degree angle, extending one leg out while crossing over to reach your elbow to your opposite knee and keep on rotating from left crossover to right crossover. And finally, slow Russian twist. Lean back, balance on your butt, have your heels either on the ground or off the ground, and rotate, touching your hands to the floor as you rotate to the left and to the right. And that is it for quarantine workout number five, three sets and each set having three exercises. Go ahead and repeat each set three times. The entire duration of this workout should be approximately 30 minutes, depending on how many breaks you take or how fast or slow you accomplish each exercise. I hope you stay safe during this quarantine and we will see you again tomorrow with another quarantine workout.